Hi Dave, I know you're out there somewhere. So I wish I could be there to celebrate with you and all my friends at the Center for Migration Studies at this gala this evening, uh, but I'm glad to at least be there in spirit and digitally. Uh, let me start by way of congratulating you with something personal, which is to say just how grateful I am for the chance to work with you over all these many years. But I also hope that the folks who are at the gala this evening get a sense from my comments of the enormous contributions that you've made to international migration scholarship over these 30-some years and counting. It started uh, with our collaboration, for me, on the casebook that you and Alex Alenikoff pioneered. Our work has grown in several dimensions, but in all of those tasks and all those projects, you've really been the guiding light for me. You have an enormous, unique range of vision, you have the courage to ask the essential and the hard questions, and you've always brought to bear on this the intellectual and analytical precision that allows us to find the best answers. And throughout this time, several things have really stood out to me, and I just wanted to say a word about each of them. One is that your scholarship has consistently bridged the divides that often separate separate fields of migration studies. So you've written about refugees and asylum and about birthright citizenship. You've written about constitutional due process and about regional cooperation. Uh, you've written about the global and the local and you've done all these things in a way that is very sensitive to the ways in which all of these many fields interact in complex ways. Another thing, second thing I'll mention is you have bridged the worlds of academic inquiry and pragmatic implementation. You've been a high-level government official at truly crucial times in the evolution of immigration law and policy in the last generation. It's really rare for anyone to combine conceptual precision and pragmatic sophistication in the ways that you have for your entire career. And I'll just mention one more thing. Uh, we've worked together on case books, on teaching materials, and it's the way that you've combined Dave Martin, the scholar, and Dave Martin, the teacher. I don't know if I'm listening to you as a scholar or as a teacher when we talk about teaching materials, and of course the answer is I'm listening to Dave Martin, both teacher and scholar. As I wrote a few years back, our work together on casebooks has been my most constant reminder that teaching is a form of scholarship, that scholarship is a way of teaching, and that both are essential if ideas are to make a difference. So congratulations, Dave, on this very well-deserved honor. I can't think of anyone who deserves more this award for international um, migration scholarship excellence. They should just name the award after you and retire it. And so congratulations again to you, Dave. Congratulations to the Center for Migration Studies for the good sense to choose you for this honor. It is my great pleasure to join in congratulating Dave Martin on receiving the Excellency in International Migration Scholarship Award. And I would also like to congratulate the Center for Migration Studies on its leadership in this important discipline. I'm sorry that I can't be with you in person to commemorate the occasion. Dave and I have known each other for decades, beginning with my time at the University of Virginia Law School. Back then I knew Dave as Professor Martin. I was a student in the very first section he taught at the school. My time at Virginia marked the beginning of my training in law and public service, and I can't think of a better mentor than Dave in those early years. He's a terrific example of the impact a public servant can make. I saw this firsthand when Dave worked as Principal Deputy General Counsel at the U.S. Department of Homeland Security, where I served as Secretary. Dave worked on several critical matters in the areas of immigration and national security, including issues related to detainees at Guantanamo and reforms to immigration enforcement policies. Over the years, Dave's continued work in the field of international migration studies has contributed to a better collective understanding of immigration and related issues. These efforts help us shape public policy and the future of our country. Thank you, Dave, for your ongoing focus and scholarship in this field. Congratulations again on your award. And oh, by the way, don't you think it's time to adjust my grade and property? <laughs> <laughs>